Hello, I'm Dr. Heather Johnston and I'm here at Paragen India in Central Asia and Distributech India here in New Delhi and I'm joined by Roland Zepek from Durag. Hello Roland. Hi Heather. Can we maybe start by talking a bit about the current state of the Indian power sector? Over the last sort of day or so, there's been quite a sort of degree of optimism out there. What's your feelings? Yes, yes I fully share that optimism in, in the Indian power market. I think the market is uh, very strongly coming back. It is a very strong market. And there, is, there are two shares in the market, in my opinion. One, one portion is the new builds, the new construction of power plants, but the other part, which is also equally important, is the renovation and modernization of the existing fleet of boilers and uh, power plants in India, which are the backbone of the Indian electricity uh, production and they need to get to higher efficiencies and higher higher availabilities through renovation and modernization. Yeah, there, there seems to be a real sort of um, wave of pushing for moving this from the subcritical level right up to the supercritical and, and even really talking about the ultra supercritical. That is correct. That's that's the new builds. That's on the on the side of the new builds. Right. But the subcritical, uh, where we have a fleet of 150 plus uh, 200, 210 megawatt boilers and uh, uh, 50, 60, 70, 250 megawatt boilers in India, which are between uh, 10 to 30, 40 years old. This is the backbone of the Indian ge generation and that needs to be modernized and if we modernize the, that fleet and we get a, a 5 to 10 percent higher output and higher availability of the plants out of them, that re replaces, quote, quote, a, a good portion of new supercritical or, or super supercritical, ultra supercritical boilers. Interesting. So obviously really Durag's main expertise is kind of looking at those existing um, plants and looking at, at elevating their efficiency. That is, that is, that is one portion of, of our focus here in the country, not only here in India, but, but specifically we're talking about India, that's one of the focus here. Uh, yes, the new builds, the ultra supercritical, the supercritical boilers is also of interest for us and we're also in that market with our components and, and products. But Durak's focus is very strongly also on the renovation and modernization of the of existing boilers and power plants. Excellent. Would you like to sort of share with me um, Durag's expertise within our, the Indian market, how long you've been serving the, the Indian power market and uh, the sort of main project? Yes, uh, Durag is directly in India present uh, since approximately 20, 20 years, 20 plus years, 30 years, uh, yeah, around about 30 years, directly present. Uh, through uh, EPCs, we have delivered to India before that, uh, but since uh, around about 10, 15 years ago, 16 years ago, we started our own uh, office here in India which eventually transformed into an Indian company and uh, Durag India Private Limited was formed uh, 10 plus years ago and so since then Durag uh, is established here in India with our own wholly owned subsidiary. So not only working through partners and, yes. and distributors but having our own uh, service, our own sales team and our own support team here in the country. That, that's fantastic to see you know, Durig making that investment and the commitment to, to India. Right. So looking forward, what are sort of Durag's plans for, for servicing the, the, the sector here? Yes, yes, our next step, we, we already do some assembly work in Durag India. But uh, our next step, and we're in the middle of, of uh, getting ready for that, is that we will uh, move uh, much more manufacturing responsibility from Germany to India for the Indian market, so that Durag India will 
for the Indian market, manufacture much more products uh, of Durax product line here locally in the country. And when we say Indian market, we say we mean the subcontinent. So what we do here is we serve uh, out of India, out of Durag India, we also serve Sri Lanka and Bangladesh. And what many people say, you can't do that, we also cover Pakistan out of our Indian subsidiary, which works very, very well. Excellent. Roland, thank you very much for, for sharing your perspective on the Indian market and, and really um, the activities your company uh, is involved in here. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Heather. Thank you.